Yeah, Glenn and Dave absolutely dreading it. And check this out right now. They are raising the prices at the Sunoco station on Telegraph. They're boosting prices about six cents. You can see them changing over the sign. Actually, 354, that's much higher. I believe the prices were in the 330 range. Anyway, prices have been jumping. And as you said, drivers are worried. A calm before the storm at the pump. Gas prices are already creeping up, increasing by an average of 25 cents since January 1st. Analysts say it's likely a surge is on the horizon. I need a raise just to keep up with it. <laughs> I guess we don't have a choice because we all have to drive. Man, we, I probably won't even want to drive the truck now. By late April, some analysts are predicting the price of gas for regular unleaded will reach 425 a gallon. That would be a record and could deal a serious blow to the economy. From taking vacations or taking time off to, you know, just spend time with family or whatnot, if we're, we're spending a lot more on gas, and it's a huge gouge, yeah. AAA Michigan says they're not ready to commit to such a high price and that the situation does remain fluid. It's a little uncertain, but in all likelihood, prices will be up for several reasons. One is that the crude oil price has been up. It's been in the $100 per barrel range. And also, we're coming out of the recession, and people are driving a little bit more than they were. If prices do jump, AAA says once again, consumers will adjust their spending. Last May, if you recall, we saw gas prices in Michigan at 426 a gallon. That was our all-time high. And that pretty much did put the brakes a little bit on the summer tourism season. Besides an improving economy, which could be leading to higher prices, turmoil in the Middle East once again could be impacting the cost as well. Just this weekend, Iran cut off oil shipments to France and Britain. And there you have it. You see that sign up there, and uh, it's definitely going to get worse, we think, before it gets better. As ABC News is reporting, one of their sources says $5 per gallon possibly by April. That just seems absolutely unreal, but apparently it could possibly happen. Reporting live in Southfield, I'm Tom Waite, 7 Action News.